Um, yeah, we look forward to next week. Um, Burlington's always good. There's a couple good teams we're going to play out there. Sterling, obviously, a conference game, and that's the next step. we got two more conference games. If we win those, we'll be uh, Western Big Six champions. That's the plan. As momentum feeding into tonight's final conference title push, Carter Venverlo's monster week that was deserves a bit of reflection here. The Golden Goal Saturday against Rochester, a program record five goals in a game Tuesday at Galesburg. Uh, it's ridiculous, and, and he's right up there. You know, we've been very blessed over the years to have a lot of good players, and, and Carter Venvelo uh, is in that company. So we're bl very blessed to have him. Yeah, I mean, it was an amazing game. Uh, I didn't expect it going in, but thanks to all my teammates' help and everybody else who was contributing, it was uh, just a great record to set. So, you know, 22 goals on a season, and when you take a look at that, uh, they've been some big, big goals for us. But sensational play up front from Carter and friends isn't the only reason the Blue Devils seem to be trending in the right direction. Yeah, I think our defense is really coming together. That's something we've been working on uh, a lot over the last couple practices. And just keeping the offense flowing is going to help the defense as well. So, you know, I think that that's the key to our success in the postseason. We're going to have to score goals. Okay, Obviously, we talked about that coming into the season. But one of the things that we've got to continue to do and, and improve on is our organization in the backfield uh, and, and our you know, defending principles. You know, we got to make sure that we deny the ball, deny the turn, uh, delay the opponent. We can't dive in. And those are things that take time. You know, and we're building and we're building toward the postseason.